Nantes perhaps willingly hit the road in their quest for Ligue 1 Uri survival with a trip to Montpellier in the weekend's opening game. The Canaries were condemned to a horrific ninth consecutive defeat in their seemingly hoodooed home last time out. 3-0 by Ren in a Bresson derby. Montpellier had a much better track record in the Mosson, taking eight points from their last five on home soil, only beaten by champions-elect PSG. Their form had been good. Home more away with three wins and a draw from their previous four and on the cusp of achieving mathematical safety. Came into this game knowing that a victory would all but secure that top flight status and came out of the traps at a rapid pace with less than two minutes on the clock with the smoke of the pre-match pyrotechnics still hanging over the pitch. The host cut through the fog at breakneck speed. The counter-attack the length of the pitch eventually swept home by Acor Adams. 90 seconds precisely. Montpellier's quickest in the top flight since April 2021. Visitors very much looking over their shoulders after two wins and two defeats since the return of Antoine Comboire. They had lost just once in their last seven visits to La Mosson. They duly hit back within five minutes of falling behind as Matisse Ablin finished clinically into the far corner. Three goals in his last four Liga Ubrich games. There's one fewer than in his first 53 in the top flight. It's cooled down after a frenetic start with only one more chance of note in the first half. Mustafa Mohamed header saved by Benjamin Lecomte. Nantes have taken seven more points away than at home in the league this season. So reasons for optimism heading into the second half. But after having started so action-packed, the second 45 didn't entertain nearly as much as both sides perhaps showing why they are in the bottom half. Laurent Molle with one chance, only able to get his knee to the ball. For just the third time this season, the team managed a shot on target in the second half. Captain Tichy Savanier has ever a bright spark. His attempt whistled over the bar. To the final 10 minutes, substitute Samuel Mutusami could and perhaps should have won it almost capitalising on some indecision in the home defence, unable to keep his effort down. No goals, but there would be a different form of entertainment late on. Lapayard entered stoppage time with 11 players on the pitch, finished it with nine. The late red cards for Lucas Mincarelli, taking one for the team. And then Arno Nordam with a shocker, a high boot on Nicola Cosa. Absolutely no debate about the referee's decision. So Michel Desacarian's men remain not yet officially safe. The extension of their unbeaten run to five moves them eight clear of the relegation playoff spot. Nantes, meanwhile, are three points clear of Rav in 16th.